Yo, what's going on, 67 on the squad? Today we're here doing a ranked 1v1. I'm playing Poseidon because I know everyone's gonna ask why. Persephone is auto banned right now. There's a bug with her. Um and as well as Bakasura is auto banned right now. I'm not sure why, but <clears throat> I'm sure it's got something to do with the patch, obviously. Um Persephone did get a rework this patch, or I think it was a little bit before this patch, so maybe that has something to do with it. But either way i will get back to her whenever she's available and ranked until then poseidon reverse um all right um it should be a pretty good game because and i i know i know this is weird but i like fighting op characters when i'm playing poseidon because i consider him extremely op and it only makes the game a little bit more even and also hopefully a little bit longer because you know a lot of people think the only <clears throat> excuse me the only struggles i have when i'm recording are you know trying to get a good game with a bad character but sometimes it's trying to get a long enough game with a good character <laughs> and i know that's like oh wow you're too good <laughs> stupid whatever no, but for real though, when you're playing like Set or Poseidon or like Hebo or something, you really have to try a few times to get it to work. So we'll see, we'll see. Maybe this guy puts up a hell of a fight and just slams me. Said, yo, yo, bro. Go ahead and type out with my left hand while holding the trigger down on my right hand. You know what I'm not looking forward to? Circuit and Ratatasker. Those are still gods that are up in the air about they're not really up in the air. I was going to say up in the air and if I can win with them or not. They're just really tough to win with. I missed. Run two minions. Doesn't matter though. He didn't do his blue buff. He went gilded arrow. Okay, well, <clears throat> I know I sacrificed a lot of kill potential doing that by Krakening the blue buff, but it also gave me so much more farm than him. He's still not level five. Well, he's level five now, I guess, but we're very far ahead now. And all it took was me sacrificing a Krakeen. A Krakeen? He's got no mana to compete with this red buff. <clears throat> so this red buff is all mine. He isn't coming over here, right? He placed a ward down, so I feel like... I would have seen him, but for some reason in my head, I was still like, Ah, what if he got past the ward unscathed? <laughs> I know it's not possible, but there's a time in the back of your head where you're like, what if it is possible? What if he found a way? Is that it? Ah, uh, you are so cool. Whatever. I'm just, I'm buffing. I'm buffing. I'm not afraid the alt buffs, obviously. If you're at my blue buff, I will take it. He's not on my blue buff. This is what I mean. Like, he just hit level 7. And I just hit level 8. All because I ulted a buff. Sometimes... Sometimes it's actually not bad to ult buffs. I don't go around ulting every fucking buff in your game. Okay? That's bad. It's funny. So if you do do that... 
make sure to send it to me because I would like to see it. But it's bad. And you'll probably lose because of it. Dude, queue up all the videos of people that send it to me when they're beating me while alting buffs. Oh my gosh. It would be it would just be like a Paul compilation, honestly. Can I alt you and just get the Aegis? Or or you know not get the Aegis. Ow, my face! Oh, he hits me for 111 Demai. <clears throat> no fucking chance I'm letting you get that blue, dude. Unless you're getting the blue. Is what I meant to say. Oh, God, he almost halted me again. He's got quite literally no mana. And I think we are in a pretty good position to re-get that red buff once it spawns again. You don't have mana. Stop acting like you're cool. You're not as cool as you think you are. Where is he? Oh, might be. Okay. Um... Now, here's the question. Can I do red buff with 100 HP and no life steal? Yes. Yes, I can. All right. You'll love to see it. Let's go. Let me go ring a Hecate. Just get a little bit of life steal going. Then I'll go breastplate because I'm a beta and I feel like I need it. Dude, we're so far ahead. Maybe I'm just really good at video games. Maybe that's it. Maybe I should rebrand myself as just the guy that's good at games. I was once the guy that was good at games. I was once rank one. But now I just play Frostbound, Frostbound Animosity and rock around going, yeah. People are like, uh. <laughs> That's stupid. Okay, does he have does he have Aegis? Uh, oh! I missed everything. Oh, but he missed his, his his ult as well. And I do a significant more amount of damage than he does. Holy. Guess he's not scared. Ow. No shot you're actually backing. Yeah. Yeah, no, I knew it. Hear your wave. Wait, I actually won that fight? What? How? Wait. <laughs> what? I actually have no idea how I won that fight. That makes no sense to me. Right, grab me this breastplate, grab me the shell. All right, nice. That really didn't make any sense to me. I gave up red buff, by the way, just then. I probably, well, I don't know if I would say I probably shouldn't have. Cause it's honestly not terrible. If you like giving away red buff sucks for fighting potential, but at the end of the day, it's just a buff for farm, right? So if you get more farm out of giving away a buff, then it's worth it. 
so we got a uh, two xp camps and a buff for a buff i'm gonna crack in here i missed my crack and i got i got ulted but i'm also okay with this because he is gonna try to pick up his his alt is this roll is kind of slapping me kind of sucks but honestly it's okay Oh, he is zoned out, dude. My man's is zoned out. Phoenix. Phoenix, Phoenix. All right. Not Phoenix. I'll just three the wave and run away. He has no defense yet. I feel like that's really greedy against a Poseidon to not go any defense. Like, I don't need a Kraken to kill you. I'm also not picking up blue, which again is kind of greedy because my mana's having a rough time. Mm. What's a good item I can go here? Maybe help with my mana, but also my damage. Mana and power. I mean, there's an obvious one that sticks out as, uh, as Bancroft's. He just, he just took a tower shot to ult me and then laugh. I'm going to fucking kill this guy. Okay. Well, I did say I was going to do it. Can't call me a liar. All right, now we go back again. And like I said, Bancroft's is the obvious play here, but I'm actually going to go Book of Thoth because it got changed. Um, it didn't get changed a whole bunch, but it, it, they increased the conversion of mana or they increased the conversion of mana to power when it's uh, evolved from 2% to 3%, which makes it actually a lot stronger. Like it's literally a 50% buff when you think about it, so... Oh my god. Talk about damage, dude. My goodness. Hmm. I would like a Bancroft. I feel like with just the Ring of Hecate, I really don't have enough lifesteal or enough sustain. Not a horrible amount of sustain. It just doesn't feel like a lot. You know what I mean? All right. Enemy alt down. You have cracking up, by the way. All right. This man just did not respect. He just did not respect the Kraken. And that is another kill. Maybe the game, honestly. I feel like my damage is so high right now. I'm doing so much. Probably can't kill him. Not right now. Not right now. Going crit chance though. I 
want to see the power spike that Book of Thoth gives me when it's finished. Right now I have 281 with red buff. I don't know how much I have without red buff. Um... Seventy five stacks. It's going to take a while to get that three more waves and a buff. One more wave. You backing? Oh, he just halted a wall. All right. So 293 or 281 to 293. No, wait, it's 281 still. Wait, what the fuck? Holy shit. Evolve Book of Thoth gives you a thousand mana. What in the hell? That is so much mana. All right, so I'm going to buy more mana items. I'm going to buy um, Ancroft's Talon. It puts me at 345. Why does my power seem so low? 80 power plus an extra 10% of my mana. But it's only mana from items. So that's actually not that great, is it? It's so 150 mana plus obviously 1000 from that. So it's 1150, it's 1450, it's 1700. 10% 10 of 1700. Is that 170? You're telling me this item with its passive is giving me 170 power? There's no shot that's true, right? That's so much damage. There's no way that's true. Because that means the item itself is 250 power. That one item. Holy fuck. I'm... Dude, I don't know if I believe this. That's that's crazy. My one just hit him for seven hundred and one. What in all the fuck? Look, dude, look at that, dude! I barely hit him. God damn. I'm gonna have to buy Book of Thought more. I wonder if my Kraken will just straight delete. Oh my god, did he brace her? No, he doesn't have brace her.
Dude. I don't know, man. 10%, right? Okay. I got hold on. I got to recalculate. I'm going to bring out a calculator just in case I'm stupid as fuck. Because there's always that possibility. Always. Here, I'll even throw it up on screen just so you guys know I'm not trolling. Okay. So. Sweet pog. Um. So, this gives 10%. Of your mana from items is converted into magical power. So we have the 150 from Bancroft's plus the 1000 from Book of Thoth plus the 300 from Breastplate plus the 250 from Boots times 10 or times point, point 10 point there. 170 power from the passive of Book of Thoth plus the 80 power from. What the fuck? Book of Thoth actually gave me 250 power in one item? That seems... Ridiculous. Oh my god, I just realized I overcapped my cooldown too. I went breastplate and pendulum and cooldown boots. I overcap my cooldown by 10%. I'm a clown. Well, dude. I said GG, right? Yeah, I did. I that that just blows my mind, honestly. I'm extremely I'm extremely excited to see Book of Thought being used in conquest now to see what kind of build. Maybe people are rushing it like they used to with Rod. His rod is a 160 damage item. The Book of Thoth just coming out the gate as a 180 power item once you finish it. That's insane, dude. But yeah, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, peace.